Dealer Center has advanced tools within the customer module that allow you to stay on top of prospects during your sales process. Sales tools like these are often referred to as CRM or Customer Relationship Management. Dealer Center CRM is designed to help salespeople and managers capture and store prospects, track activities like calls made, emails sent, and appointments scheduled, gain visibility into sales pipeline to see who needs follow-ups and when, and streamline tasks like emails. Prospects are categorized into different stages called statuses. A prospect status, along with their activity history and notes, allows you to see exactly what's going on with any potential customer. You can see where they sit along your sales process and what kind of follow-up is needed. Dealer Center has a few main statuses. The new status is the starting position for every customer. When a prospect is added to Dealer Center, either by being manually entered in or automatically added as an internet lead from your website, they always start at new. And they stay in that new status until some activity has been recorded. Next, any internet leads that you are calling or emailing or texting but have yet to ever talk to or get a response from will display as contact attempt. The system will count each attempt you record so you can see how many times you've tried to reach this prospect. A prospect in the contacted status is someone you've spoken to on the phone or received an email or text message from. Maybe you've even had some back and forth emails or multiple phone conversations, but that's as far as it's gotten. When you see appointments scheduled, you know this person has set up a fairly specific time to come into the dealership. For example, maybe they told you they'd be in this Saturday afternoon. You may even want to follow up and call prospects at this point to confirm their appointments. When you see missed appointment follow-ups, you know this is someone who either canceled their dealership appointment or just didn't show up. It's recommended that you continue to call and email these prospects to try and reschedule. Finally, when a prospect comes into the dealership, they will either leave as a customer who you sold a car to, they will be a lost opportunity, maybe for example, you know they're buying from a dealer across the street, or they'll be a prospect you'll want to make sure you follow up with again. Prospects listed as dealer visit follow-ups are those potential customers that came into the dealership but left without buying a car. Keep in mind that it's common for a prospect to jump statuses. For example, you might get a walk-in and enter that person's basic information into the system. Their status is listed as new. After they look at a couple cars and leave, the status would be dealer visit follow-up. In another example, a prospect calls into the dealership to ask about a specific car. Again, you capture and save their contact info into Dealer Center. The prospect starts as new, but by the end of the call, it would probably be contacted or maybe even appointment scheduled depending on the outcome. Check out the next video on using CRM that goes over recording activity and working prospects.